but you talked about and you know and, and you know Rachel the subject matter which was the one that was the most appealing part to you because I mean the film is a valentine not only to journalism but it's also a valentine to victims that have been suffering in the shadows which both of them were appealing the if, for me yes but both um, I think I was shocked at how little I knew about the abuses that I knew kind of my way around the subject, but I didn't know the intricate details. And I wondered if maybe everyone, or a lot of people didn't, and that, you know, there's, there was really such um, a need to keep telling this story. Um, and the more I got into it, you know, the more I realized that it, it, you sort of can't tell this story enough. So like Michael said, it became a no-brainer to do it, regardless of the outcome. And I'm so grateful that this is the outcome, but no, we didn't know that going in. And then to be able to play these reporters um, who are unsung heroes, who worked in kind of in the back door of, of their own place of work. Spotlight was very kind of um, its own department and uh, people didn't really know the ins and outs of that. And, and they just are really hard workers, and um, so to be able to, but they do extraordinary work, and, and they don't always get that recognition, so to be able to recognize them like that was really um, a gift. And, you know, and Tom said, they're all on board, you know, for, as an actor, just, just as an actor, it was an incredible thing to have access to the person you're playing, and he said to me, you know, you can call Sasha tomorrow. She's... Mm -hmm. She's so ready and willing to 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 um, be a part of this. So I, I'm. She's here tonight, and I'm so incredibly yeah. grateful. Yes, to her for that. Sasha Farber.